Yes! You're a lovely bastard. Douch him in the nose! Ah! This island is overrun by disgusting creatures. You shouldn't stay here over long. Do you have a problem with ducks? The way they act just isn't normal. Like when you wake up in the middle of the night and they just stare at you without blinking. Something about them just isn't right. I think we should kill all of them. Better safe than sorry. He's completely barking mad. What are you doing here in the middle of the wilderness? I came here with the pirates. They provided me safe passage. I stuck out on my own to find out how bad things were on the other islands. What do you mean? The Shadowland, of course. I wanted to know how far it had spread. I'm stuck here for now. I could try and get you out of here. Well, that's kind of you, but no thanks. I think I'll stay here and study the island for now. If I really want to get out of here, I'm sure I'll manage it. You lured the ducks here. You're full of shit. I've done nothing of the sort. It was your idea to light a fire. But only because I thought ducks were afraid of fire. Apparently you were wrong, eh? Yeah, okay, I admit it was a daft idea. So what do we do now? Now we have no other option. We have to kill the ducks. Personally, I think we should kill them all, just to be sure. But let's wait and see. Maybe that was their final attack. Well... Let's hope so. I really thought there were abundant riches on this island. Instead, the only thing you can find here is death. You're shitting a brick, aren't you? It's not you who's threatened by the servants of death. I'm really close... I really thought there were abundant riches on the... Instead... You're right. I know I'm right. These vicious monsters are everywhere. I'm really close to leaving. This is getting too dangerous for me. Why? What's up with the ducks? Ducks? They aren't ducks. They are servants of death, my friend. What the fuck? Have you ever woken up at night and felt like someone was watching you? Well, I did wake up last night. And they were there, standing all around me, staring at me with cold, lifeless eyes, as if they'd drive me mad at any moment. Maybe you're overreacting. I know what I saw. I think the ducks are controlled by a greater power. A power that makes them fly about to test humans and see which are ripe for the picking. We are nothing but food to them. They feed off our thoughts. Probably there's a chief duck somewhere, controlling the others. If we could find that duck and kill it, I think it would end the horror. Why are you still here? Why? Well, because I can't leave. We landed here because we were told that many treasures can be found here. And then someone double-crossed us. The entire crew is either dead or are scattered in all directions. But it doesn't matter anyway, because our ship has sunk. I guess those bastards from the Inquisition were more lucky. I will kill your evil duck if that makes you feel better. Would you? Seriously, that thing scares me to death. No matter what Fletcher says, I don't want you to kill the other ducks. They are peaceful animals. So be careful when you fight. Where can I find this evil duck? Well... Let me guess. Inside your head. What? Don't joke! The duck really does exist. I never doubted it. Head northwest from here. You should encounter it pretty soon. You'll recognize her. She looks... 
suspicious somehow. You want to kill harmless ducks? As a matter of fact, yes. Those monsters are obsessed. I've seen a lot of things, but this? No oh, thanks, I don't want any part in it. I'm not gonna kill any peaceful ducks. So you've been listening to Hull, have you? You're probably one of those damned white knights, eh? I'm not killing any peaceful ducks, the poor animals. But if they show up again, I'll take care of them. Funny, for some reason I suddenly thought of the word rump. 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 Sounds funny when you keep repeating it. You don't say. Your duck was a soul eater. Huh? I knew there was something wrong with that duck. Is it dead? It won't cause any more problems. That's very good. Here, take some gold. Everyone needs gold. What about the peaceful ducks? Did you spare them? I spared them. And I'll leave them alive. Excellent. Here. Take this as a reward on the duck's behalf. The little beasts don't deserve to die. Your evil duck is back. What? How? Oh, come on, stop playing tricks on me. I thought I'd had it for a minute. Here's some gold, but don't ever scare me again. Agreed? Agreed. Why don't you join the Inquisition? No, thanks. I prefer to stay here before I go crawling to the Inquisition. If necessary, I'll tie up a couple of sea turtles and make myself a raft. Don't worry about me, I'll get off this rock. One of those ducks was a soul eater. Seriously? That hull was right after all. Well, that explains a few things. But don't think that I'm becoming less observant. I'm probably never going to trust a duck again.
I'm going to make it.
I'm going to make a pass on your That's what I call a ship graveyard. Imagine the stories these planks could tell. I'm telling you, settling here makes no sense. Be quiet. Someone might hear us. So? Aren't soldiers allowed to be afraid? Not when they're on duty. That's bollocks. Pull yourself together. Why don't you adjust your gun so you'll actually be able to hit whatever comes at us, instead of whining? The Titans aren't to be taken lightly. Yeah, either way we're fucked. Damn mosquitoes bit me ass again.
I'm going to make a hat out of your skin! Well, that's that. I'm going to make a hat out of your skin! Lovely thing. Better squished. I'm going to make a hat out of your skin! Bloody spiders! I get to use my weapon! Message in a bottle. I wonder what it says.
Hey, leave some for me! Ugly thing. That is Chris. Sometimes I get this itch. That's always a sign that we'd better be careful. And sometimes it just stops when I take off my trousers. And sometimes I wish you'd never dug me up. What do you want? Got to focus on my training. Why are you training? There are only two reasons. One is to get the other hand in a fight, and the other is women. They love this shit. But why am I even telling you this? So get lost. What's your mission? Can't you find another ear to chew off? Oh, all right. I'll tell you just this once, okay? So listen. Listen carefully. Hector and I are supposed to secure the food supplies. But that can wait, because what we, what I found here, is more important. Carlos can wait. My new wife can't. What do you have to offer? Here, have a look for yourself. I'm going to make a hat out of your skin! <clears throat> I was here first, she's mine. Kindly find yourself a woman somewhere else. And I'll buzz off to Carlos and make yourself useful. And you can take Diaz with you. I have no intention of taking anything from you. Sure you don't. You've trudged all the way here just to enjoy the view. Nothing of the sort. Cersei is gonna be my wife. Looks like he's desperate. You don't take your duty seriously, do you? What are you babbling on about? Have you now seized command here, or what? I'm doing my duty. So save your advice for someone else. You haven't seen a woman in a long while, have you? Of course I haven't. They don't fall out of the sky. And when you do have one, you have to offer her something. Such as? Take a look at my muscles. When I start rippling these, she will just melt. You can touch them if you like, 
No, you're all right. Well, who do we have here? You must have traveled a long way. You look tired. Come and spend some time with me. Maybe some other time. Oh, are you in a hurry? Or do you get nervous in the presence of a lady? No, you don't seem like the type. Forgive me for saying so, but I feel so incredibly safe around you. You must be quite the ladies' man. Cut the fucking crap, sweetheart. Why such anger? Have I offended you? I've held out on this island for so long, longing for someone I could cling to. You look like someone who could take care of even the biggest of problems. Maybe one day you'll have time to render me a service as well. How did you get to this island? You certainly deserve an answer, so I'm unable to answer it. But there is a grey veil surrounding my memories. It feels like I've been trapped here for an eternity. What can I do for you? Oh, it's always the same, you know. Just as soon as you find an admirer on this island, they only want one thing. And I've got two such admirers. They're a plague. And what do you want me to do about it? Oh, well, if you're man enough, then... Then again, no. It would be wrong to trouble you with this. Oh, come on. Out with it. Well, I'd be over the moon if they were to go away. Forever. I'll think about it. You do that, but you'd be doing the world a big favor. Only their death will ensure my freedom. Just imagine what will happen when the other soldiers find out about me. Men who have been alone at sea for weeks can be cruel. We're supposed to play hired assassins for the bride? That stinks! <laughs> Told you before, take your hands off her. I have no intention of doing so. Get it into your thick head, she doesn't want you. Ah, and what makes you so sure? Well, who'd want a pushover like you? You think she'll be impressed by your muscles? Ridiculous! Just shut your gob. Why did Carlos have to assign you of all people to me? Because one of us has to do all the thinking, and it can't be you. Sod off, then. Hector doesn't seem to like you. That sounds like him. He's just jealous of my wife. But I'm not surprised she rejected him. With a face like that, he'll be looking for some time. Serce wants you dead. Me? Never! She wants to start a family with me. In which case, I'll quit the service and she and I will grow old together. You must have heard wrong.
Cersei wants me to kill you. If you think I'm buying that, forget it. She told me she'll marry me. Why would she want to kill me? Watch your mouth. Hector says you promised to marry him. Typical charlatan. When you're done with him, I'll cut out his tongue. I'm tired of all these lies. Diaz says you want to start a family with him. <laughs> you fell for that. I hope I don't need to question your dedication. End it. I don't believe a fucking word you say. Your task was to kill them both, not to question my intentions. You humans are all the same, weak and stunted. Now you're paying the price for your unreasonable behavior. Saw that demon a good lesson. Your family plans are history. What did you just say? Uh, I can't imagine what would have happened if he hadn't helped me. Shortly before that, I was with her. You know? It's all right. We've all woken up next to a dog. Yeah, thanks. Look, it's not much, but you should take it. What are you going to do now? Uh, I need to clear my head. This whole thing's done me in. It's not every day you get a ride like that. Anyway, Hector and I still have much to discuss. Good comrades forgive each other. Looks like we can forget about marriage. I feel so... emancipated? The divorce works wonders sometimes. Hey! Stop joking about it! That beast wanted to kill me! I definitely wouldn't have survived without your help. Here, this is the least I can give you. Come for me!
creatures. Going to make a hat out of your skin. <coughs> that was fast.
spider! I'm going to make a hat out of your skin! <laughs> <laughs> 